Hello YouTube, the X Porker here with you. Let's take a few minutes today and show you a couple new uh, toys and items I got to add to my collection. Not a whole lot of fancy stuff, just some nifty stuff to me. And thought I would uh, do a short video and share it with you. We'll start off with a uh, got a new uh, Streamlight stylus pen for to add to one of my bags that I carry. Probably put it in my back backpack with my laptop and my iPad. It's a great little light. It's a stylus by Streamlight. Pretty bright little thing. It's got a 100,000 hour solid state LED in it. They say it's visible up to a mile. Now that I, I can't contest to, but if you turn it on, leave it on, it'll, they say it'll last for about 60 hours. It's got a momentary button on the back. You either push it for however long you need it on or twist the cap and it'll it'll stay on solid. Pretty pretty nifty little pin. It's made out of uh, aircraft aluminum and of course with most Streamlight products comes with a serial number. So it's handy to keep track of your stuff. But moving on. Next is uh, got a couple of Kershaw knives. Kershaw Leak, as you can see. It's a really nice knife. It's a little small for my hands, but I uh, went ahead and picked it up to add to the collection. It's made out of a uh, 14C28N stainless steel blade. Of course, it has the uh, thumb opening and the assisted opening. Pretty nice. whichever you prefer to, to use there. Blades three inches, handles four inches, so overall we're looking at it seven inches. And uh, like I said, it comes with the thumb stud and, and the pocket clip. And it has a little locking feature on there to keep you from opening it accidentally or whatever. Not necessarily a need for, for me, but uh, you know, each to their own. So I won't complain about that, but nice knife, I like it. Uh, moving on, next we have um, this little fella. It's the Kershaw Lockback. Not very big, but you know it's Kershaw, so I went ahead and got it, added it to the collection. Um, be something to pass along to my kids, you know, one day when I'm not around. You know, it's a folding knife. Got a drop point on it. You know, blade length's two inch, handles two inch. Overall, it's four. Of course, it's not made in America. This is one of their China products. Uh, it's made out of HCR 13 MOV stainless steel. And it's got the injection mold and handle. And it weighs a whopping one ounce. But, uh, you know, I've seen it. Nine dollars. You know, I said, what the hey? Went ahead and got it. Add it to the collection. Be something to pass down. Next one, it's going to be a Kershaw Half Ton. I actually uh, seen one of these in a store one day and, and loved the way it felt. So, you know, I thought it just had to have it. So, went ahead and ordered that. Got a pretty decent uh, price on it. A great feel to my hand fits perfect. Me, a great little uh, box opener or what have you. It's made out of the uh, same steel as the uh, lock pack is HCR 13 MOV. It's got a two and a half inch blade and three and five eighths inch handle, and it weighs in at three ounces. Pretty good knife. I like it. Not bad at all. So. Got that for the collection, and uh, a few other things, you know, never had an axe before, seen this, uh, it's on the snap-on truck the other day, and you know, every time I get on that truck, it's that's usually a bad thing, but uh, he's also a Kershaw dealer, so I picked up this camp axe, never know when you'll be out shooting in the woods and maybe cut away some brush or something, so picked this little thing up. Uh, comes with this K2 
Kydex looking little holster. Snaps closed. Put it on your belt. Whatever. Pretty sharp. You know, right there is what sold me on it. This is Kershaw. It's a model 1018X. It's made from drop forge from solid high quality high carbon steel. And it weighs about 14.5 ounces. Comes with the lanyard on it. It's got a great feel to it. I can't wait to get out and do some uh, chopping with that. I think I'm going to take the kids out this weekend if this snow they're calling for holds off here in the old WV. 70 degrees one day and snow in the next. Gotta love it. And probably my most favorite thing out of everything that I got was the Kershaw Blur. And you'll see why it's my favorite here shortly. But uh, it's, a, it's a great knife. Got the speed safe opening with the uh, thumb assist. Like that. Love that speed step. Love it. It's made out of 448 tungsten stainless steel. It's 3 and 3 8 inch blade. And 4 and a half inches closed. And the overall length is about 7 and 3 quarter inches. The uh, weight's 4.2 ounces. And the thing that makes this my favorite knife, Snap-on. Where would a man be without his Snap-on tools? Gotta love it. Sharp. Probably never use this knife. Probably just add it to the collection. Just because of it being a Snap-on. But let me pick up one of the, the plain ones. Because uh, I really like this knife. It has a great feel to it. And I love that assisted opening. Fabulous. But, that's just a few of my new toys. Probably going to do a video tomorrow for uh, 80 sub contest. I uh, really appreciate you guys that put up with me and, and watch my videos and support my channel. So, I picked up some items today. I'm going to do a little contest. Not sure what the, the subject matter is going to be yet. Still thinking on that. So... That's it for today. Guess we'll see you sometime tomorrow. God bless. And it is what it is.